It's Kobe Day, man. We got to throw it back to this, man. I was listening to this song in like sixth grade, getting me all hyped. We got to turn this bitch up, bro. Defend your best player. He will shoot from the perimeter. He will yep. get all the Fuck, man. Dude, I'm I look so tired, but rest in peace to Kobe. I'm recording this on August 24th. Kobe Day now. Yesterday was his birthday, man. Shit. Rest in peace to a fucking legend. Every time I watch anything about Kobe or read anything about him, it's just so sad, man. Does this look good? I don't even know. I haven't picked up this camera in fucking years. But first thing I want to say, dude, I'm trying to... This shit might fall. First thing I want to say is hopefully everyone's doing good. Hopefully everyone's quarantining, wearing a damn mask, not going out in public places without a damn mask. Because overall, it's just going to keep you safe. It's going to keep your family safe. It's going to keep others safe. So yeah, second, I want to say hopefully everyone is supporting or trying to do their best about Black Lives Matter because this world is fucking crazy, man. Even if it's just signing petitions, just try your best to stay educated on this type of stuff and just keeping others educated because some people, some people don't get it. All right, so it has been a long ass time since I made a video on this channel. I think it, I don't even remember my last video, but I think it was in 2017 Then I just started streaming Fortnite, so. It is crazy. I'm gonna split this video into three different parts. My plans for the channel now. Number two, uh, I don't know, just reflecting. I keep hearing noises. Just reflecting on what's been going on. And then number three, why I stopped. So, first part, I don't wanna keep this video long as hell. In between the three parts, I'm gonna do some skateboarding so it's not all just me talking. So number one, my plans with the channel. So, I wrote a bunch of stuff down just so I don't forget shit. So number one, I'm moving to Chicago for school, which is insane, I'm so freaking excited. So I wanna vlog my journey through school, document it all, through living at the dorm, through living in the city, also meeting new people, freaking getting better as a person in general, getting better as a photographer. I'll also be skateboarding a lot, which would be my transportation pretty much. So I'll have a lot of that in my videos. My schedule, I want to upload once a week. I don't know if it's going to be like every weekend. I move in on the 5th, which is a Saturday, so I don't know. The reason why I want to do this is so I can look back on this time in my life, five years from now, ten years from now, and just see it. It's like home videos pretty much. This is going to be my first time moving out of my house. And I feel like a lot of people can relate to this. People going off to college, people moving. Follow my Instagram, it's art97 and Roman numerals, X-C-V-I-I. -I. That's where I post everything, all my photography stuff, my adventures, everything. So just follow me to keep updated. Let's go skate, because I'm thirsty as hell from talking too damn much. Oh, it's wet. Come on, bro. Something I learned from the last time I started making videos, I learned how to tray flip. This trick took me eight years to learn. Not literally, but two years into skateboarding, I freaking tried this trick forever, couldn't get it to flip fully. 
just gave up on the trick, right? Uh, six years later, I learned the trick. I could die happy now. Yeah. <sighs> that took like five tries, but finally getting better at that trick. I could pretty much land on the board. You can't see me at all. I could pretty much land on the board every time I try that trick. And that's progress. I am tired as hell. Part number two. I swear if a cop comes over here saying I can't be up here, I'm gonna be pissed. Yo, this place is low key a vibe. What the hell? You can't even see shit. If you're from my Instagram or I just recently met you, you probably don't know that I used to do YouTube to this sun. So yeah, I used to upload mainly video games, but I did do some skateboarding videos, some vlogs, and I started in 2015. Yeah, because I just got an Xbox and started grinding Call of Duty. But even before that, me and my friends would always record us skateboarding, put it on YouTube, and that was in like 2011, 2012. By the time I graduated high school, I had uploaded over 500 videos, which is kind of crazy to think about. Recording, editing, uploading, everything all by myself, just me, camera, freaking capture card for the Xbox and a laptop, that's pretty much it. 500 plus videos. You're wondering what I've been doing since quarantine. I've just been really skateboarding, playing video games, obviously. I've started investing right before the quarantine stuff started happening. I invest in Ethereum. If you're wondering, that's like the second biggest crypto and that's a ton of fun. It's super stressful, especially in the beginning when you don't know what you're doing and you start losing money, but it's all good, you learn everything you do, you learn from. And what else have I been doing? I've just started doing more photography stuff. I did this car shoot with my friends, which I just met like, I met one dude yesterday and his friend I met like three weeks ago. I'll put some of the videos and photos on the screen right now. I'll try to remember to put a bunch of my photography work in the first part just on screen so you guys can see what I've been up to. Uh, what, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, I started taking photography more serious like 2018, so I've been doing it for two years and I'm actually very happy with what I've accomplished so far. After doing what, those four or five tricks? I am tired, man. I did learn two tricks I'm super proud of. The first one, big spin front board on a rail. That trick is so damn fun, I'm gonna put it in right now. I am dying, bro, you cannot see me. I am dying. The second trick, it's not really that crazy, but I did a little half cab 50 on that thing. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Bro, there's a dude running like a lunatic out there. All right, part number three. Let me see, so this is gonna be why I stopped or started to slow down. So I don't even know why I started to stop. I think it was a mixture of things. After high school, I had no idea what I wanted to do. I was just some skater kid who liked playing video games. Nothing really interested me. But right after high school, am I recording? Okay. Right after high school, I got a job with my friend. It sucked, but I saved up that money and bought my camera. The reason I bought that camera, I don't even know why I bought it, but thank you, Lord, I bought it. I just wanted to learn like how to use it. Mainly wanted to use it for video, but I started taking photos when I went on my first Cali trip in 2017. I just started taking pictures of anything. They all pretty much sucked, but to start whenever you try something new you're gonna suck at it so just you just can't be afraid to suck at something and with that camera the Canon 70D 
I even did a test video on that and an unboxing video on my channel, so you could probably find it. I also got kind of bored making videos on just gaming. I always wanted to vlog, but living in the suburbs, there's not much to do. And now moving to Chicago, there's legit endless things I could do, skate, just walk around, try different restaurants, anything. Hang out with friends, go to the beach, go anything. These vlogs I'm gonna be doing are actually gonna have a purpose. Not saying that the gaming videos don't have a purpose, but they are more like entertainment for the viewer. So I'm super excited to start this next chapter of my life and for you guys to see it. It's gonna be a crazy journey these next two years. And I'm super excited. I'm getting cooked right now by the damn sun. If I forgot to add something, I'll probably add it in when I'm editing. Yeah, that's the end of the video. Hopefully it wasn't too long. Oh yeah, one thing I did wanna say is I wanna make the videos as entertaining as possible, but I also want to just document everything. So hopefully I could find a balance because the more footage I have when I'm older looking on these videos, that's just better to see what my life was like. So hopefully I could find a balance between entertainment and the amount or how long the videos are. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Subscribe, leave a like. I haven't said those words in two and a half years, three years. But yeah, I am out, peace.